I've somehow managed to lose the clip of me introducing this vlog. I don't know where it's gone. I don't know what's happened, but it's lost. So this is like me at the end of the week jumping in. This is one of my favourite vlogs I've done so far. I really enjoyed filming it. Had such a fun, wholesome week. Yeah, I hope you enjoy watching it. It's now going to jump back to last Monday and I am shopping in the shopping centre and doing a little bit of book shopping, just looking for a little bit of shopping. So yeah, the next clip, that's what you're going to see is that. Yeah, I hope you enjoy this video. Um, please subscribe if you haven't already. And if you're one of my 40 subscribers watching this, thanks for already subscribing. <laughs> And yeah, enjoy the video. Bye. This jacket is so cute. I really want it, but not for that price tag. I came in here the other day and I saw this and I just think it's the cutest thing ever. They've basically just like wrapped all of the books up and with a description. It's like a pick and mix. That was really cute. And this is the only section I'm bothered about at the minute, fantasy. And everyone is obsessed with this because I think Sophia um, shared it on her Instagram. I don't know why they read it, but if you are wanting to read something, read that. I'm so tempted to buy another book, but I've just got like so many at home I don't need any book. Book shopping is my favourite thing to do. I think I just. Love this place. It is really expensive though. Like I could just get them on as and not go to the works. This feels nice to buy them, you know. This one is next on the list. I'm gonna have to buy me a bag because. That was like the most unsuccessful shopping trip ever. I don't think I really want to buy something, but I just can't see anything that I like. It's just in the, all the shops. I did get something from my desk in the food section before my Valentine's night though. Yeah, I'm just going to sit and wait for my mum to pick me up now and go home with nothing. <laughs> At least my bank account's better. Morning, it's currently 7am I'm on my way into work. I'm very tired, but we will power through. I've actually just put on for a yoga class tonight, so we'll see if I make that. Um, but yeah, happy Tuesday. Only one more day of my 8-day street before I'm off of five. <laughs> Okay, I've just finished work and I'm gonna head to the gym. Go get something to eat there. And then I'll do my yoga class. I'm actually kind of regretting booking it now, but it's what it is. I have to go. Good old Manchester weather means that it's pissing it down there, so we're walking in the rain. Very fun, at least I've got my hood. I kind of hate vlogging in this position though, because you can see all of my chins. But I don't want anyone else to watch me, so. No, guys, I'm actually mortified. I've just been stood here, and the car's just gone completely soaked all the bottom of me. Fucking fuming. Okay, this is gonna be my little setup for the next, like, hour or so. I'm gonna get some lunch or dinner. But yeah, this is my food that's just arrived. I sweet potato fries and fries every day of the week. I think I've just come on my period and I'm feeling really overwhelmed and anxious. And we were just doing like deep breathing at the end of the class and I just got really overwhelmed and started crying. So I'm probably just gonna sign up for tonight. Um, I'm sharing this because I always said if I started a YouTube channel, I would show like the bad things as well as the good things. And obviously I'm having a bit of a shit evening. I'm going to go home now um, I'll probably sign off for tonight and then hopefully I'm feeling brighter in the morning. Hello, I am really late for work 
Um, I literally just need to put them on my socks and shoes and then leave because I've had all morning. I haven't done anything. Um, I am feeling a bit of a better mood than I was yesterday, but I'm not feeling great, I won't lie. But I've just been listening to Adele when we get ready. Because we managed to get tickets to go and see you this morning. Like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> but yeah, I need to go. I'm just like, curl my hair. I need to go to work now, but I'll update you all on that later. I just wanted to kind of check in. Let you know I'm feeling a little bit better. Because I know I ended last night with so a bit of a downer. So yeah. <laughs> Isn't it just so fun being a girl? <laughs> Good morning. Okay, I'm in a really good mood today because I've just finished my eight day streak. I did eight days in a row at work and <laughs> I was dead by the end of it. Um, but I've now got five days off because we're obviously going away this weekend. And today I'm having like a little pamper day. So I'm going to leave now. I'm going to get my hair done. Finally, that's why it looks such a mess now. Um, it's quite long at the minute and I think I want like this much cutting off and I want like face framing again things like that I'm not colouring it because I quite like my colour and I've never dyed it so I'm just sticking to this um, and then I'm going to go and get my nails done as well I think I'm going to go for something Valentine's -y. Um, I've hit hands last night as well and I've got like this spot in my brow it's really bugging me because it just looks like my fake hands patch and it's not I promise um, but yeah, I'm just kind of excited to have like a little wholesome day. The weather is shit outside. I'm gonna just say, oh, good for it. Go on a holiday. Amy wants to go travel in my other's my It's raining and I've just had my head. And I don't want to ruin it. Oh! I'm actually going to vlog watching uh, um, because I don't know the girl that well yet, but I am buzzing. I love it. I really like the length of it. So yeah, I'm actually just going to go the coffee house now i'm probably gonna go on my own but if it's busy i'll just get a drink and walk back out so we'll see oh my god i think it's snowing this isn't rain this is snow what the actual fuck i've just gone to the toilet um in the coffee house to show you my hair properly because i'm before it like falls out and the rain ruins it how cute i'm literally obsessed with it I'm here on my own, I'm like gonna sit and eat on my own. Who the fuck is this new Ellie? This is <laughs> wild. I've got a table on my own, I'm not gonna go on my phone, I've never got my headphones. Yeah, we're making moves because I've got to do this in Oz anyway. <laughs> It's still like snowing slash raining and I'm fucking freezing so I've just had to order me that. I don't want to ruin my hair but look at the state of me. <laughs> Honestly like I just want to document and like say that I don't often do things on my own. It's a car walking past it. <laughs> walking, driving past it. I don't ever do things on my own and like well I've been trying to but obviously I'm a very anxious girl <laughs> and doing things like that on my own like going out for lunch and like sitting in on my own is something quite daunting and overwhelming and I don't often say this very much but I'm actually quite proud of myself for doing it like I don't know like obviously I'd love to be able to sit there and talk through the camera and do that but it's just a bit overwhelming but yeah we've made a step in the right direction and I am feeling very proud of myself right now <laughs> Okay, I am back home now. It has been a very successful day. I didn't show you my nails, but I'm sorry. How cute. They're very Valentine's-y. They are gonna be like my birthday nails, but also it's Valentine's Day next week, so I wanted them to be like Valentine's-y as well, which is, I just think they're so cute. So I'm like obsessed. You know when you get your nails and you're constantly like tapping things, that's what I'm doing. I had a very exciting delivery while I was out. It is from Lululemon again, so you guys can see. Um, 
but I actually don't at the minute just have like a funnel neck one and this one just struck me like I was obsessed with it. It's called Heathered Bone. Um, I say I'll leave it in the description down below but I don't think I'm at that point yet where people care enough about what I buy <laughs> to hunt in it but if you do want it I can leave it in the description down below. Um, but yeah, I'm obsessed. I'm going to take it away with me this weekend. I don't know if I mentioned, but I am. We are going on a little weekend away. Um, so yeah, like I <laughs> can't wait to wear that. Literally just finished as well reading this book. So I started reading it. I want to say I started reading it about three weeks ago. And I lost it and left it in one of my bags and I just didn't end up finishing reading it. So I started a few days ago and I've just finished it. Oh my god, I love this. This series is really good. I read, so there's like th four of them. I read Twisted Love when I was in Australia last year and loved it. And then got my auntie to read it and she loved it as well. I'm all here for a little bit of smut in the box. <laughs> my mum's going to be watching this. I'm all here for a little bit of spice in these books. Not too much, but some. Like, I like it. And this book just is giving all of that. I'm obsessed. I love this series. 10 out of 10, definitely go and read it if you're not my cousin Freya and you're older than age 18. <laughs> you see me doing this with my nails. Just obsessed with them. Anyway, I need to go now because I've been talking for five fucking minutes. I'm so excited to be editing this later and see how much like I was chatting shit and <laughs> how much I can edit out of it. But yeah, I need to pack because obviously we're going away this weekend. So I need to pack for that and yeah that's pretty much it <laughs> i have literally just missed the tram <laughs> i went into town real quick i gave myself enough time in case i missed it i didn't check the time it's before i came which is so typical i'm sat on the tram now i'm going to town to meet baby and have some breakfast catch up because i'm not here like a week and then i'm gonna come back because we're going away i forgot to bring a coat <laughs> And I'm freezing, so I'm just gonna wait for days and I'm actually just like walking around so that I keep warm. I actually just love being in Manchester though. Like, if I wasn't moving to Australia, I would definitely consider moving into the centre of Manchester. Like, there's just so much to do here, and it just feels a little bit more. I don't know. Doesn't this bit look really cute? Fun fact I actually went on a date in there once. It's actually quite a cute place for a date. Just didn't end up kind of seeing the guy. <laughs> <Don't laughs> <laughs> we've stopped at our services and we've got um like a little farm shop and I'm literally obsessed. I love going to farm shops anyway but they just have like the nicest stuff. I need some new hot chocolate. Because I'm such a sucker for things like this. Like, that's three pounds, but I feel like I want it because it looks so nice. <laughs> I feel like I want one of them just because they're so cute. I think they're the cute as well. Okay, but I thought it's kind of thing. Oh, this looks so nice. I forgot to update you all before. But we've just been to a service station and we're now about like 20 minutes, half an hour away. What the good? We have arrived. I would love this bedroom specifically. Oh, hi. For the bath. It's gorgeous. We are like walking around there like with all these like, wooden doors. No, no, it's not going to pass in the room. No. It's giving salt burn vibes. Oh. I'm scared that like someone's gonna jump out. <laughs> Let's see. They've all got really nice. Right, I want like wooden beams like this <laughs> in my house <laughs> when I'm older. Like, I just think they're so cute. And then this is the view, stunning. And we did just need to get blown away though coming in. But it's gorgeous, like, look at that. 
literally salt bear vibes. Good morning. I've just got out of bed because I want to show you the view. How stunning. I wonder if I can zoom in. You can see like all the little sheep <laughs> out and about. It's just so cute. Why is it so zoomed in now? Okay, that's better. And then you come around to this side. And the sun's on this side as well. So cute, and then that's my bed, so literally like, when I was in bed, oh, <laughs> stunning. I would have <laughs> <laughs> I have just got ready, we're going to go for a little walk, um, I should have washed my hair when I got in the shower this morning, I didn't and I'm really, I know I don't myself but I'll do it in a little while, and this is the first time I've like put it up in a pony since I had it cut, it feels so short, I actually forgot to bring a toothbrush, so I didn't brush my teeth last night. So we're gonna walk inside the little village and hopefully I can find one there. <laughs> I need to buy some more sunglasses because I obviously lost them in Australia and it's still yeah. a touchy subject but I can't see now while I'm vlogging. Anyways, we're off Mom to the village chic. bakery. She's As always. My, she's not wearing my scarf that she brought without asking. She's not allowed to wear sure. it. No. <laughs> not if you don't ask first. <laughs> We've had a lovely start to the day. Yeah. Nice and chilled. Well, I went into the hot tub. Oh, look! That, that's looking right at me. I wondered what that what was. The horse? Yeah. <laughs> anyway, go to the village. Big. <laughs> <laughs> I think Mum secretly wants to be a vlogger. I think we should, oh, it's loads of fun. we should do like a family vlog. I think you want to be. I do. I do, I do think I do. I don't know. Maybe you can take the reins and hold the camera and vlog sometime this week. Yeah, that's what I saw staring at me. Oh, there's a car coming. guys so i haven't vlogged today we've had a very chilled morning it's now like half past two we're getting ready because well i am ready because we're going out for dinner i've just um curled my hair with the straighteners and i'm obsessed with the way it looks and i've got on this no jumper from sisters and seekers and we are ready to go out so i've just kind of tucked in here and then, oh my god, I'm not making the bed yet. Also, I cannot tell you how much I love this box. I'm like, that's how much I've got left to read. So I'm on page 355. I am obsessed. I'm in love with Kai. I love Kai and Peyton together. Um, I won't give any spoilers, but yeah, like, I'm just obsessed with this. Um, I kind of want to finish reading it this weekend. Got to stop looking at my hair because I'm really happy with the way it turned out. I'm having a very lovely, relaxed weekend. I'm loving spending time with my family. I'm loving having like a bit of a switch off. And yeah, it's just been very fun. What have you ordered, Oliver? <laughs> 
Stop it, So, guys, we just finished our roast dinner. I would rate it an 8 out of 10. Oh, would you? I think I'd do 7. The meat was nice. The roasties were nice. The roasties were like 9 out of 10. They're like the, the best roasts I've ever had, like on a roast dinner outside of home. I am full now though. I'm out of breath is what I am. The classic phrase. Sick of forking me, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. We didn't have a dessert or a starter either. So. I was just saying, if not everyone gets a starter at the table, it's selfish. Because <laughs> then if you're not having a starter, you're just sat watching everyone else eat, waiting for your food. Yeah, but you would have got a starter if there was something that you wanted on there. Yeah, but it's selfish when I'm not getting one. So if you're getting one, it's all right. But if you're not, then it's not okay. Correct, indeed, Ruby. Oh, so how good does Ellie's hair look? I said that in before we came out. Oh, it looks a bit light there. I think it's the lighting. But well, I've just I hit my head in the car <laughs> on the way here. And She's hit like, her head. No, it's actually slowing up. Oh, it's not slowing up. It's hurting. Ellie's the most dramatic person you'll ever meet. She'll be in A&E with that tomorrow. <laughs> We're going to go back, relax, have some picky bits. Okay, so it is now the next day. I'm just going to close this vlog to a bit of an end. Please ignore the fact that like, I was reading that book last night. I was like, biting about it because I was so nervous. And now it's all swollen but anyway. Um, I've had a really fun and lovely week. Um, this like little staycation has been really nice. I've just managed to turn off, have a little bit of a rest. I've woke up with a headache now, so that's like, but we're about to travel home. Just packed up. Um, and yeah, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. If you've got to in this video, because I feel like this video has been a little bit of a longer one than normal. Thanks so much for watching. I am going to vlog this week. It is Valentine's Day week on Pancake Day and my birthday's the week after so i'm probably just gonna have like a fun little week so i thought i would vlog the next week as well um i'm really enjoying like documenting things and vlogging my weeks and things like that um and i hope for anyone watching that you are enjoying watching as well so yeah um also finish this book 10 out of 10 literally 10 out of 10 the ending was not prepared for that at all i won't talk too much about it because i don't want to give any spoilers but i cannot wait for the next one of this to come out in may cannot wait bye